Okay, what's up everybody? Welcome to your Daily Dose of Awesome. This is Fernie Ceballos. Uh, let me just check to see if we are live and then we will get going. Sorry, I'm a couple minutes late. So thank you for your patience. Uh, let me see what's going on here. We will get going. I have a pretty, uh, an, a, something that I've been thinking of for a while and it was actually uh, something I want to share with you guys uh, that was actually triggered by a discussion that, that uh, we had uh, recently with with somebody uh, that was uh, going. Sorry, some quick questions so. that had some quick questions on how to make money now and so that is the topic of today's uh, daily dose of awesome so people are rolling in what is up everybody how's it going hey Scott all right cool I just I'm just setting the video here so I can monitor comments what is up so all right what's up everybody this is Fernie Smiles welcome to your daily dose of awesome Today, I want to talk about how do you make money now, or the question we're asked all the time, how do I make money now? Just tell me what to do, show me step by step what I need to do to make money now. So that is the, the, the topic that we're going to be coming in today, and the answer to this question, if, if you approach it correctly, uh, can actually change your life. Uh, and what I want to share with you is actually a way of thinking about the skills you're acquiring here at Elite Marketing Pro that can A, get your results faster, but B, uh, give you a little bit of a, of a reality check uh, in terms of what it is you're actually trying to accomplish here. So that is a, that is discussion here. Uh, and essentially what, what it is I want to talk about is how entrepreneurs are paid. So what what is the difference between being paid as an entrepreneur and how do our entrepreneurs paid and so hey everybody so people are starting rolling hey Angeline Jennifer Lisa Michael what's up man uh, Chuck Thomas Scott so uh, so again I want to just right, hop right into the content I don't want to make a, a long one like uh, last time so what I want to talk about so um, something was happening recently um, we were we were talking to one uh, one of our annual members so he was just getting started and um, and it wasn't me having this conversation, but it was actually one of our mentorship coaches, and uh, and so this coach uh, was talking to this uh, this uh, this annual member, and uh, he was pretty much you know uh, maybe a couple weeks in, and he pretty much out of frustration was very frustrated and just went, how do I make money now? Just tell me what I gotta do right now to make money now. Uh, and the and and the response to that question, he wasn't a big fan of, and uh, and and so the response was given, and then he's like, no 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 no, just just tell me what I need to do to make money now. Now, be honest, how many of you have had this thought, uh, frustration, that 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 idea go through your head? How, what do I need to do to make money now? Drop me a number two if you've had that thought in your mind as it relates to you know starting to generate money in your business you want somebody to just simply tell you how do i make money now just tell me what i need to do so that some money comes in just be honest number two you know i'm looking for some some honesty here so so that's how the conversation went back and forth and and, and then the, the mentor gave a response a very detailed response and then the guy was just like no 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 that, that's not what i'm looking for just tell me what I need to do to make money now, and uh, and so that was pretty much you know the the I was having a conversation with the mentor about this conversation with uh, somebody who was pretty brand new and and didn't you know didn't understand a few things yet. And the bottom line is is what this person was looking for. Uh, and thank you for your honesty, guys. Uh, what this person was looking for was step by step give me what i need to do to make money now and that mindset i mean that that belief that there is one that that somebody in the know can give you one two three jackpot that type of sales that type of process um is is a process that is commonly found among employees when an employee signs up for a job uh, they're going to be paid no matter what they do. So they they ask, okay, okay, boss, what do I, what, I, you know, what do I do first? And then they have an onboarding program where they teach them a few things and then they start performing the job 
And then the employee usually has no problem. I mean, the employer has usually no problem paying them after they've performed said job, whether they do it bad, good, uh, whatever. It's not a performance based uh, situation. And the and, and the employer understands that hopefully over time, this person is going to get good enough at that job so that uh, so that, you know, the what they're paying them, you know, eventually is worth it. And so that's how an employee is paid. And and it. You know, it's no surprise that we come into uh, network marketing and we come from an employment situation and then we're asking those who are, you know, uh, who are working with, who are mentoring us, tell me, just tell me, give it to me straight. How do I make money now? And the and the bottom line is that there is no straight. How do I make money now when it comes to being an entrepreneur? And, and that is the straight answer because entrepreneurs are not paid like employees. Uh, and I have some notes here and my notes are actually have said, I have an, uh, whenever I, I have an, uh, an idea or what's a somewhat of an original idea and, and I think it's an important, uh, what, my, what my mentor Blair would call a, an important mind model. Uh, and a mind model, essentially a, a, a process on how to think about something. Uh, I write it down and I, and I kind of came up with some, some uh, a mind model of sorts uh, as it relates to entrepreneurship. And, and here's the bottom line. Point number one, entrepreneurs are not paid to do work. That's point number one. Entrepreneurs are not paid to do work. So the answer that this individual was looking for with regards to just tell me what work I need to do. Tell me what, tell me what I need to do so I can make money now. Well, the bottom line is entrepreneurs are not paid to do work. Now, you guys, can you guys tell me uh, in the comment section, what are entrepreneurs paid to do? So, uh, so no number here, actually tell me, what, what is it that entrepreneurs are paid to do? So you could just, guys, just give me the feedback. And, and so the reason this is, this is so important, it's because it actually is going to set proper expectations and, and mature expectations and realistic expectations for a what you can expect from being an entrepreneur, but b uh, realistic realistic expectations on how long it's going to get, how long it's going to take for you to actually get a return on the actions you're taking, a return on your investment, a return on the education that you're investing in here at Elite Marketing Pro. And so answers are rolling in. Uh, Amy, uh, you said. They're paid to get results. Uh, Cecilia says, recruit new team members, business builders. Cecilia, that is an interesting answer. Um, and Michael is, be creative and follow a system. So uh, Veronica says, provide solutions. So those of you, the rest of you who are watching, I'm, I'm assuming you you are, you follow and say, okay, there you go, create solutions. Uh, this is this is great. Um, so these are actually really, really, really great answers. Uh, and, but there's obviously there, there's some that are more accurate than others. Uh, the bottom line is Amy is, is more accurate, uh, in that, uh, Amy is, you know, paid to get results and providing a solution. Well, you're not just paid just to provide a solution. The solution has to work. Therefore it has to produce a result. So uh, on my, on point number two here is like entrepreneurs are paid to get results. So entrepreneurs are paid, are paid to get results, and that's what, and, and that's how it works. But it still might not make sense to you as to how come, you know, I can simply can't just give you a step by step path towards you know making money now. Okay, entrepreneurs that get results, just show me the steps to get results. And this is where it, where it gets tricky. Point number three here is like, you can't get results without certain skills. So you can't get results without certain skills. And, and uh, this is where the thinking of that new person that is not yet an entrepreneur, that is trans in transition, coming from an employment situation to uh, starting a network marketing or even starting to learn attraction marketing. This is where their brain starts getting scrambled a little bit. You can't get results without certain skills. So in other words, to get paid, you know, receiving money is a measure of value that you give to the world. So when you give a certain measure of value, you receive money. And so I simply can't teach you how to how, what, step by step, like do this, do this, do this, and you make money. 
because the parts where you're actually doing something need to somehow provide value to the world so that somebody is willing to reciprocate with their actual dollars. And so uh, you, to get results, you need new skills. And that's what we focus on here at Elite Marketing Pro. We're teaching you new skill sets. If you've learned a new skill set and being a part of this community, drop me a number five. Let me know if you've learned at least one new skill since starting here with Elite Marketing Pro, a number five. Now, point number four is that these skills are acquired through work in the form of study, action, evaluation, and repetition. So, yes, we provide you a lot of processes here at Elite Marketing Pro, and, and those of you who are uh, responding with a number five have learned a process and you guys have started acquiring a skill. Now, those of you, and this is intentionally meant to be a certain, uh, meant to be a little bit of a, a challenging question for you guys. If you guys have mastered, absolutely crushed and mastered at least one skill here, uh, since you've been with Elite Marketing Pro, drop me a number seven. Drop me a number seven if you've actually mastered and crushed a skill that you know that you could, you just per, you perform this and, and money's gonna come out no problem. Let me let me know if that's the case. And and so, but here here's the reason I asked that question. Skills are acquired through work in the form of study, action, evaluation, and repetition. And and so, if you need skills to to produce results, and entrepreneurs are paid to get results, then is it? You guys tell me. Is it reasonable? to be asking somebody in an entrepreneurial venture, hey, tell me what I got I got to do right now, uh, what I got to do to make money right now. Is it reasonable or does that, or or should the the per person who's answer, answer, asking that question instead be asking, hey, what skills do I have to acquire? What skills do you have, to, do I have to learn? What can, what may I learn so that I, can, I so that I can actually provide a service or do something that of value the world, so I can earn money. Earn money, and so for my last question, those of you who have said you mastered a skill, some of you are working on it. No, not yet. Great, awesome answers, and I appreciate your honesty. Uh, yeah, it takes work. It takes work to acquire a skill. What we do here at Elite Marketing Pros, we're teaching you a professional skill set. Attra being an attraction marketer is its own profession. Being a network marketer is its own profession. And and guess what? Professions in this world aren't don't come easy. You need to learn a subset of skills to be a, a to not only just be a master of that profession, just be competent in that profession. And and uh, you know that's what we first start you off here at Elite Marketing Pro, learning one skill at a time. And as you learn more of these skills and you start implementing, then your results start going up, 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 and eventually uh, you're able to perform these skills at a certain quality level that can provide you more consistent and consistent results. And you're gonna be measured that what you're gonna make money on is on your professional ability as an attraction marketer or as a network marketer. And, and that, when somebody asks, how do I make money now? What they're really looking for is how do I, how do I how do I pretend to be an entrepreneur but you actually give me a job? And there's nothing wrong with having a job. There's nothing wrong with being employed, but the expectations and how you should be approaching it are com are completely different. You are you what we are doing here is we've entered when we left when we left um, or now we didn't you know some of you are still at your job, but when you chose to cho to do network marketing when you chose to actually take part in what we do here with attraction marketing, you guys actually chose a different profession and there's a different professional skill set. So, so tell me yes or no, if you think acquiring a new professional skill set should take some time and how much time do you think is reasonable to acquire, to, to be acquiring such a valuable professional skill set? This skill set for me has resulted in millions of dollars for me. So you guys tell me right now, how you know should should this professional skill set take time and how much time? So say yes or no, and then how much time if you say yes, do you think 
such a valuable skill set should take for you to, you know, be, be, be pretty good at it. Let's say you guys tell me what is reasonable and, and we all are all going to have a little bit of a different perception on what is reasonable. I mean, what I know is that I went to school to be an engineer and that took about four years and only then was somebody willing to hire me and pay me for that skill set. And, and the awesome thing is that what is required of us here as attraction marketers and as network marketers that nowhere near comes to, you know, comes to the level of, of, of requirements that, you know, getting a degree as an engineer or as a doctor or as a accountant or whatever, people work really hard to acquire those skill sets. And then, uh, and then they get, uh, uh, you know, get paid to deliver value using those skill sets. And so uh, the way you acquire skills is first you, you study, you learn, you take action, and then, and then when you take the action, the next step is not, you know, get disappointed by the results. That's not one of the steps <laughs> in how you acquire skills. Uh, the stu study, you take action, then evaluation, you evaluate. You look at your results. What can you learn from those results? What, what, can I, what can I tweak? What didn't work? What worked? What didn't work? What, what might I do differently? Going through a process where you're evaluating, the, the last daily dose of awesome that I did last week is part of how you work through this process. You know, that, that uh, success formula is something you actually use in the evaluation phase when you're looking at an ad, when you're looking at something that you performed and you got results, good or bad, and now it's time to figure out, okay, what are my next steps? And then you repeat. So once you, you once you come out, you know, once you kind of take what you learned, you form an action plan, uh, you make some tweaks, and then you repeat. And then it starts again. You study more. Uh, action, evaluation, repetition. So you have to work to acquire a skill. The skill produces a result. The, re the result, uh, you know, the result essentially allows you to invest in more study and then you work. The investment can come in the form of if you produce a result and you get a return, the investment can come in the form of, of your ads or come in the form of education, come in the form of upgrading your membership with Elite Marketing Pro, whatever that, that investment come, that, that what form that investment comes in, that's pretty much the cycle. That's how this works. You work to acquire a skill, you produce a result, uh, the result allows you to invest in yourself and then you you go back to work. And the work consists of study, action, evaluation, and repetition. And if you want to know what the evaluation part is, what that consists of, how do you effectively evaluate, then you want to go back to the Daily Dose of Awesome I did last week on the success formula because that is an evaluation type process. If you guys are getting this, drop me a number three. Let me know that this is resonating for you guys. And, and here are the, the answers that I got. Uh, and so Chuck Kerwin says, uh, absolutely, this should take time. We're acquiring a new professional skill set, 12 to 18 months. That, Chuck, that is a very mature and, and reasonable timeline. Now, the question is, somebody says one year. Somebody's saying, uh, so somebody's saying they took me eight years to get a bachelor's and a master's. So for it to take at least a year, if not more, to learn these skills is not unreasonable. Guys, I am so proud of you guys. You guys are th are are approaching this what we are doing here like a professional. And professional skills to produce your result to make a first few bucks shouldn't take too long, but the requirement is you have to approach it with the proper mindset. And the proper mindset is understanding is what you guys just shared with me right now. The proper mindset is that you guys understand that you're learning a professional skill set. It's going to take a little time. What we do here at Lean Marketing Pro is we teach you to learn uh, as few skills at a time as possible, which is the reason we have you get started with one skill, which is advertising, you know, Facebook ads. And then we take it from there. And the cool thing about also knowing this is it actually, well, if you, if you bought into what I've shared with right now, then you've actually taken pressure off of yourself. Because a lot of you guys put a lot of pressure on yourself to make money now, make money now, make money now, because uh, you've you know invested whatever you invested uh, uh, in your education here at Elite Marketing Pro. 
But if you if you think about it like as if you're paying for college, uh, and that's the reason I talk about in some other trainings I talk about going to Facebook University because when you're running when you're running ads, what well, your investment in the ads, uh, if you view it as your investment in your education, you're going to Facebook University and you're trying to graduate from Facebook University and the only way you graduate from Facebook University is you get really good at Facebook and your tuition is going to be what you're investing in the form of ads. If you look at it that way, then there's no emotional attachment. As long as you've set a budget that you could afford in your education, then you've approached this, uh, the acquiring of these new skill sets that can change your life with, uh, in, in a mature way. And then you can also do that with the rest of the skills we teach you. You can look at what we are doing here, like a new type of uh, college, new type of education, new type of university, and, and if you look at it that way, then all of a sudden, uh, the cost of that education is not that high relative to what it is people pay to get a job, to, you know, what people are willing to get in debt for, uh, to get a university education, get in debt, and then get a job that requires them to work for 30 years to pay off that debt. And so hopefully this is helpful. I see it in a lot of number three, so I, I, I appreciate that. And so... Uh, Amy says, depends how much time you have to devote to the skill set development during that year or two. Absolutely. And and to gain a level of mastery where you're producing some pretty awesome results, a reasonable expectation if you're hard nosed and have committed and your every waking moment that you have to spare, you're focused on developing these skills, you're focused on this business, and you're constantly investing in yourself uh, through this process, investing through uh, running running advertising so that you can learn as much as you can using the available resources in terms of our, our weekly call uh, check-ins for our VIP members and those of you who are part of Fast Track, you guys know the resources you have. That is the, the, the best thing you can do for your education, for your skill development so you can actually get paid. And ultimately, the people that get paid here at Elite Marketing Pro, the people get paid as affiliates, as network marketers, are the people that acquire the skill sets, not the people that promote a certain program. A certain program Having a certain website, having a certain thing is not going to get you there. What's going to get you there is your own skill development. So ask yourself, um, and I'll close with this. Ask yourself, what might I do so that I can, so that I can perform an action that, you know, so what might I do that so I, I can perform an action that might produce a result? So ask yourself, what might I do? Most of you already know what that is. It's step one, you know, running running Facebook ads. But running Facebook ads with with you know care. You're studying how it is you do it right. How how do you, how do you do it effectively? And then also you get a result. That's all you need to do. Focus on getting the result, good, bad, whatever. Now you have the opportunity to learn from that result. You have the opportunity to evaluate. You have the opportunity to grow. The most of the learning is going to come from taking the action and getting the result not from what we have to teach you. So uh, that's it for today, guys. I hope this was, this is helpful for you guys, especially those of you who, who uh, have, may have stopped investing in yourself. And what I mean by stopped investing in yourself is you stopped taking action. You stopped running ads because, you know, something's not working for you. It's like it's working for you. You're producing a result that you can learn from if you choose to look at it that way. If you choose not to look at it that way, that's how you are giving other people around you the, uh, the unfair advantage because you're giving other people around you an advantage because you're not out there in the marketplace competing. So go out there to compete and the, com the competition is a, is a marathon. It's long term. Choose, set aside a budget to invest in yourself so you can actually take the action you need so that you can get as much information back so that you can continue to learn. And without the action, you cannot learn. So take care, everybody. Have an awesome day. So this is a little lesson on how entrepreneurs get paid. Entrepreneurs are not paid to do work. Entrepreneurs are paid to get results. You can't get results without certain skills. Skills are acquired through work in the form of study, action, evaluation. See the last daily dose of awesome for that part and repetition. That's it. Take care, everybody. Have an awesome day. I hope this got uh, this provided value for you.